Hello, everybody. Kenny with Four Wing Helicopters, and we're breaking down some airspace classes for you. My full-time student, Justin's here today, and, and we've been talking about how much there is to learn about airspace in the beginning when you're first studying this, and as time goes by, you, as a current pilot, you have to go back and review airspace because there's a, a lot of things to think about. So this time I want to talk about Class G airspace, Class Golf. Uh, most of your small airports, like the one where we operate at, which is the Plymouth Municipal Airport, with my new sweatshirt, thanks to the gentleman downstairs, the airport manager, Dave. Thanks for the sweatshirt, Dave. So anyway, Class Golf. Normally, the most small airports are Class G. And the biggest thing that's hard for people to learn and is very hard for students coming back, maybe a guy who is an airplane guy working on his helicopter add-on, the thing that everybody screws up, and I've seen this over the years many, many times, what you have to commit to memory is Class G goes from the surface up to 700 feet inside the magenta circle at a Class G airport. Outside of that magenta circle, the Class G is from the surface up to 1,200. And in the beginning, this can seem pretty tough and can be pretty hard to get. So draw yourself an example. Use whatever tools you need to get this clear in your mind because the examiner is going to ask you. He's going to give you examples inside and outside. He may give you AGL. He may give you MSL. So you really have to look at the Class G and you have to really think about it. So whether you're a brand new student, your guy doing a helicopter add-on, or you're going for a biannual flight review. You gotta go over these airspace classes, and the class golf is the one that gets people all the time. So the big memory aid for class golf is inside the magenta circle, from the surface to 700, is class G. On the outside of that magenta circle on your sectional chart is the surface to 1200. That's that's the big key. So Hopefully this helps. Stay tuned for everything else we got coming up. And please share with your friends on Facebook and Twitter. And we'll see you all very soon. Thanks a lot. See you later.